What's up guys, it's me Packy with The House Channel today and I am bowling a doubles tournament with Chris Barnes. So I gotta go down to Richardson, AMF Richardson down in Texas for a doubles tournament tonight and then there's a big 10K event this weekend that I get to go bowl. Uh, so hopefully, I know it's, I know they're gonna be a little softer, so hopefully a lot of striking. Uh, but I want you guys to let me know down below in the comments if you could bowl with any PBA member, who would you bowl with? I think Chris Barnes is probably mine, but if you could bowl with any doubles partner for the PBA, who would it be? So let me know down below in the comments and I'll see you guys in Dallas. Well, I didn't exactly do my job game one. I started off the gate with a 173. And let's just say the scores are not low. So we're bowling on a house shot, 173. Chris shot like 230 or 250. So I gotta step up here game two. So games two and th so games two and three are over. Um, more of the same. I shot 20190. I switched balls about six times. I've tried throwing it harder. I've tried throwing it, hooking it more. I've tried throwing slower balls, quicker balls. I'm not really sure what the answer is here, but I got to figure something out for game four in Baker, or we are going to be practicing the rest of the tournament if I don't step up. So. Uh, Chris is bowling really well. He's shooting 250s pretty much every other game. So I got to help him out somehow.
right, so the back half of game four, I tried urethane, and I think that's going to be the play going into match play because all of my other balls looked bad. I shot 160 that game. I split three times. I just couldn't catch any breaks, couldn't get anything going. So hopefully with the new game plan, urethane, I'm going to take some hand out, throw it harder and straighter, and hopefully going into the Baker set, we can make a run. Uh, we're still not too far out, seeing as the tournament's only halfway over, but we definitely have to do a lot of striking in Baker. We are four games through the Baker set. I've done a good amount of striking. Chris has done a good amount of striking. We haven't uh, really strung a huge game necessarily, but we are definitely making up ground on the cut. Um, just the fact that I'm not splitting every third shot is helping us. And Chris has got a decent enough look where uh, we really just got to catch a couple breaks one game, string a couple big games in a row um, instead of, you know, a 10 pin or an 8 pin or a 9 pin for 240. Uh, we need we just need those to fall so we can shoot 260 one or two games in a row. That way we can really get something going and uh, give ourselves a chance to get into this top four. All right, so that was it. That wraps up the Baker, or the knockout doubles, or whatever the tournament was called. That wraps up the doubles tournament that I bowled with Chris Barnes. I'm I'm just hoping he asks me to bowl again sometime, because that was embarrassing. Did not bowl well. I definitely figured some stuff out. Got a really good look in the Baker. You know, I caught some bad breaks here and there, but I definitely, um, I didn't split as much. I hit the pocket pretty much every shot, so... Uh, I think urethane is going to be the key going into this weekend, and tomorrow I got a couple sweepers to really just practice more because it's 
It's like a $40 sweeper. There's not going to be too many bowlers there. So might do some filming tomorrow. Catch you guys at the sweepers. Peace.